In the wake of the Harvey Weinstein scandal, stories of sexual harassment and assault have spread from the entertainment industry to corporate America, journalism, and politics. A third woman has now come forward with groping allegations against former President George H.W. Bush. He has now apologized. And political analyst Mark Halpern is now facing new public accusers and fallout. ABC's Lindsay Davis is here with the latest. Good morning, Lindsay. Good morning, George. A one-two punch for Halper in this morning. The book he was working on about the 2016 election canceled. And not only the book publisher, but HBO is also pulling the plug on a project they were planning with Halper. MSNBC is now announcing political contributor Mark Halperin will no longer be appearing on the network after at least five women have come forward alleging sexual harassment when the Game Change author was political director at ABC News in the late 90s. The women, who were all in their 20s, shared stories of Halperin propositioning them for sex, making unwanted sexual advances, and pressing himself against them. This morning, more women are coming forward to allege they either knew about the behavior or experienced it themselves. Former ABC News researcher Diana Goldberg told the Washington Post she reached out to Halperin for help with a story, but says he would only help her if she sat on his lap. ABC News says Mark left ABC News over a decade ago and no complaints were filed during his tenure. But the women say his high position at the network stopped them from coming forward. CNN senior correspondent Clarissa Ward called Halperin's behavior an open secret when she was an international reporter at the network from 2007 to 2010. She tweeted out, as if most of us at that age aren't just trying to be seen as competent equals with a bright future ahead and not a potential HR headache. Let's be very clear. The one responsible for any sexual misconduct that may have taken place is the man who instigated it. Halperin put out a statement saying he did pursue relationships with women during his time at ABC News. He says, I now understand from these accounts that my behavior was inappropriate and caused others pain. For that, I am deeply sorry and I apologize. And Amy, he says now he's taking a step back from his day-to-day -day operations and will focus on this situation.